part two, I am so sorry. We were filming something else. The camera cut because we don't have a lot of space. So we have to hurry. Um, so what I did was, I didn't think I was going to have a nice weather. So we started uploading, which used a lot of space. Um, so let's finish quickly. Um, we see Dexter create, a, create another criminal. And this time, it's kind of nice because we had multiple times where Dexter tried to frame somebody else. But ultimately speaking, the person he was trying to frame was his victim. We saw it with Dokes, we saw it with Miguel, but now he's, fl he's framing someone else so he can kill Archer, which I think is kind of interesting. Um, there's a lot of scene where the daughter of uh, the shitty killer is in the uh, interrogation rooms, and it's kind of nice because it's like she's protecting she's protecting her father and she's the education of the character but in my opinion it's sad because you've seen a daughter protect her father who doesn't give a fuck about her it's kind of sad it's really sad you know but it adds to the character of the the girlfriend of quinn i think she needed that i think she needs to do that till the very end to prove her dedication to her father and i think it's gonna take debbie because she also had a dedication to her father see the season one and season two Debbie was all about promotion, was all about ambition. And later season we don't see that as much, right? We're seeing this with the biggest quake, the biggest case of the Trinity Killer. But we think that she's going after the Trinity Killer because he killed Lundy. Right? If she realized that Ice Shock Killer was somebody important before uh, the end, she would have went after the Ice Shock Killer, but she couldn't because it was too late, you know? And that's pretty much it for episode 11. Not a lot going on. There's more so about we find a body. Dexter is able to save a little boy. Uh, there's a really cool scene where Elliot, the neighbor, hit Rita. And again, it's not because Dexter pretend. I, I don't know. It's hard to it's hard to say. Does Dexter really love Rita or is he pretending? It's really hard to say. Um, I think he has some love for Rita, but I don't know if he loves love her. I don't know if he's able to love a person at all, right? Um, which is possibly a psychopath or a sociopath, possibly a, a mental uh, disorder, not his fault. Um, but then she tells him, Ella, kiss me. And Dexter's like, oh, well, I don't really give a fuck. He doesn't say that, but he doesn't act in a way where he shows that he cares a lot. And then there's this beast inside of him, just a way of, of just a position, just a imagination, just a picturing of Dexter uh, where he goes to punch Elliot and Rita see it and then he apologizes and Rita said no it showed that you care and it's kind of cool because Dexter right Dexter has been killing left and right left and right right and it all did it to protect Rita he all did it to protect people Brian Mosley knew where he lived he knew about Rita he knew about the kids Layla knew about the kids right Leela sorry it's a lot of people. Now, the, the finishing scene, which is the most important scene of them all, is very important. The Trinity Killer finds out that his real name is Dexter Morgan. And you know what's crazy about that? The whole of episode 10 and 11 was about Dexter and Trinity Killer going back and forth. Ah, I know who you are. Um, I'm blackmailing you. Don't know who I am, right? It's a constant battle. And Dexter had the upper hand. But now, Trinity Killer has the upper hand. Trinity Killer as a brand because he knows he's Dexter Morgan. And guess what? Trinity Killer? See, you know the funny thing is? You know the craziest thing about the Trinity Killer? The craziest thing about the whole thing? There's no way you're gonna understand. Dexter, who is wearing a mask in most cases, just like a Patrick Bateman, right? He wears a mask. <sighs> to show that he cares, to be part of society. Right? Trinity Killer was a family who was a business, was lived his whole life hiding his true identity, who has more than one kid, has less to lose, losing the family than Dexter. See, Dexter had a family to pretend like he cared, but then he pretended for so long that he ended up caring for them. Archer never cared, or he did care and now he don't care. The way he hurts Jonah, the way he treats his wife, the way he treats his daughter. That sucks. Dexter has more losing his family than Archer. And to me, that's the biggest of them all. You know that Dexter Morgan, which Dexter can fight, but Dexter now lives with Rita, now has his young son, Iris. And there's multiple moments that I didn't mention before. Um, there's multiple moments that I didn't mention before because they don't seem uh, big enough. They don't seem impactful enough. Where you see Dexter being sweet to his, his son, 
Arison and protecting him and saying, I'm not going to hurt you. Nobody's ever going to hurt you. The, the reason why I don't mention him is because he doesn't treat differently Arison. He treats uh, the, the two other kids, Cody and Alster. And that's great. You shouldn't treat any kid different than the other. It doesn't matter if they're, they're stepchildren or your real children, right? doesn't matter. However, because we've been seeing Daddy, da, da, Daddy Dexter for four seasons, I didn't mention it. But maybe it's not the fact that it's a it's his son that matters. Maybe it's not the fact that it's Harrison is a baby that matters. Maybe killing a baby is something you would never do. But maybe it's eating that something that Trinity Killer will do. No matter what, Dexter has a line. You won't trust. Archer doesn't have that. See, the thing with Miguel. Miguel was possibly the, the, the biggest uh, counterpart to Dexter. A lot of people are going to say Brian, which was the Ice Shot Killer, but I don't think so. I don't think, I don't think Brian would have killed Dexter. I think he would have hurt Dexter. I think he, at the very end, he would have possibly hit him, but he would have never done that. Leela did it. Leela did it, right? But Leela was not a killer. Brian was a killer. Archer. Oh, Archer will go all the way. And he is a killer. Not one time, not two time, and not any time. You know what the craziest thing? In any cases. So there's three, it's in three killer, is three, right? Trinity. Now there's four. If you add another 30, that's 120. On that note, let's get this. Peace. Okay. <laughs>